Hi everybody, my name's Max and I'm here today at the Nix Branch Library uh, with a STEM demonstration for you. Um, you can access all of our virtual programming for the summer and moving forward on our website, which is nolalibrary.org. Uh, today's program is called Fun with Fingerprints. It's a very simple uh, activity and all you need is some scotch tape, a pencil, and some scratch paper. Now let's all start by taking a look at our fingerprints. As you can see, if you look very closely at the tip of your finger, uh, that there's a little pattern in your skin. There are little swirls and whirls and arches, little circles, all kinds of different patterns. And each fingertip on your hand is completely different from every other one. Um, also, every fingertip in the world is entirely unique, which is why uh, police investigators take impressions of fingerprints so they can see who might have touched a certain surface. But you might also ask yourself, why do we have fingerprints? Uh, the answer to that is that fingerprints help us to grip things, to better use tools, and to use our fingers for all kinds of different purposes. All right, so today, we are gonna take impressions of our fingerprints so that we can get a better look at those patterns because they're pretty hard to see just with the naked eye. But if we take an impression, we can get a nice look at all those individual patterns. All right, so what you wanna start by doing is taking your pencil and coloring a nice dark, dark spot on your piece of scratch paper. Now make sure it's nice and dark because you wanna have a lot of graphite left over on the piece of paper so that you can pick it up with your fingertip. So as you can see here, I've got a nice dark spot on my piece of paper. Now I'm just gonna start with my index finger. I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna rub it around all over in that dark spot. Now you wanna make sure you roll it around and get the edges too, so that you can get an impression of that whole fingerprint. Okay, so as you can see there, my finger is nice and dark, covered in the graphite from that pencil. Then I'm going to take a piece of tape, about an inch, an inch and a half long, with my clean hand. Then you take that piece of tape Press it right over the dark spot on your fingerprint. Okay, there we go. Make sure you cover the whole fingertip. Then you're going to pull that piece of tape up and then place it on an index card or another piece of scratch paper. And there we go. If it's worked right, Left over on the paper, right there on that piece of tape, you should have a nice impression of your fingerprint. And you can get a good close look at the pattern. Now you can repeat that process for each one of your five fingers on that first hand and collect your impressions on your index card. Here I've made one. So we're gonna make one for our right thumb, right index, right middle, right ring, and right pinky fingers. And then if you'd like, you can repeat that process for your left hand, and then you'll have all 10 unique patterns. All right. Um, once you're finished with all 10 of your fingertips, you might ask yourself, what other things could I find impressions of? Is there anything else in your house that you can use the scotch tape to take an impression of and have a little memento of that object. Or maybe you want to ask somebody else in your household if you can take their fingerprints and then compare all the patterns. It's fun to see how each of them is completely unique. All right, um, check out our website, nolalibrary.org, for all of our virtual programming moving forward. 
And thank you so much for tuning in. All right.